snowfall is back for another powerful season. It's about the beginnings of the crack cocaine epidemic in the 1980s. First thing in the morning, we head up to Oakland. Visit swim. Get enough rock to tie the over. Maybe even talk our way into they connect. Set up a pipeline south. That's what we're gonna do. I'm down. Same. Good. Get some rest, man. We'll link up at Jerome's in the morning. Oh, it's a good show. Yeah. Please welcome the show's creator, Oscar nominated screenwriter and director John Singleton, and three of the stars of Snowfall, Damson Idris, Carter Hudson, Angela Lewis. Yes, welcome back to Chicago. <laughs> Yes, good to be here. It seems like you guys were just here talking yeah. about the show's inauguration on FX. So congratulations Thank on you. being picked up for another season. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, John, when did you know this show was a hit? Um, I guess... When he cost me. When he cast me. Definitely, definitely, definitely. <laughs> but last season, is just, see the response that everybody w loved the show. It was great. It was, you know, people were, were just... A lot of people seem... There are people who lived through this and people who never knew about it you know and, and it's like an amalgamation of all these folks and they had comments about, like this is this is some interesting stuff right, right. and yeah. Idris you were saying that our uh, damson you were saying yeah. that <laughs> wait Idris, 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 cool. yeah. Idris yeah. Yeah. Hey, we can run with that yeah. Damson, you were saying that you know you're from the UK yeah. and you were not aware of everything that was happening mm -hmm. in the 1980s what, what, what was your perception when you learned about this for the first time well initially I just thought that America was basically just Hollywood and Brad Pitt and then after watching Boys in the Hood, yeah. I kind of saw when this gentleman right here, which yeah. John directed, of, of course, course. Yeah. And I, I started to see the insight of, you know, the kind of darker areas of America. And I saw a complete correlation to where I was from in London, in Peckham. So I read into it. And then, yeah, it blew me away about the story and what it's done to the people today. Describe your character in this story and set it up for folks at home who may not have seen it. So Franklin Saints, a young 19 year old kid from South Central, who's, you know, into playing out with his friends and, and wrestling. Mm -hmm. And then he stumbles into this cocaine um, industry and then right. decides to instead become a CEO of a company, sell cocaine. Yes. So, uh, <laughs> street pharmacy. Exactly. Street entrepreneurs. <laughs> yes. Street entrepreneur. Right yeah. term. Yeah. <laughs> what about you, Carter and Angela? Tell us a little bit about your yeah. characters. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, I, so I play Teddy McDonald, and he is a, uh, a CIA officer who... Uh, was running an under-the-table operation, um, funneling all of this cocaine into uh, Los Angeles from South America. Um, He's evil. It, well, <laughs> <laughs> that's unfair. He's, uh, we'll say misguided. He's funding Mischievous. a war. He's funding He's, a war the government wants to happen. You know? Right. And Angela, describe your character, and what are we going to see different from her in season two? Mm, so Aunt Louie is Franklin's wildcat aunt. Um, she's in this dream deferred space when we first meet her. She's kind of smoked out, but she's really looking for an opportunity to move up and out and she sees this opportunity with Franklin and she wants to jump on it. She makes some power moves at the end of season one and season two we watch that those get backfired on her or backfire on her. She's actually the most gangster she, character she, on the show. What, wow. What's so the most wow. for me. character on the show is this. <laughs> Sweet woman right here. <laughs> <laughs> what struck me so interesting, I'm looking at you guys, and you play the aunt of Damson's character, but looking at you in person, there can't not be that much age difference for you. That's how it is, is, it? How it is in the hood. Like the, yeah. Even the mamas look like they can be the sisters, and the aunts are like, you know. When yeah. I was good. in the first grade, the little boy that sat next to me was an uncle. <laughs> you are kidding me. That's, that's I'm it. absolutely serious. Wow. <laughs> yeah. I was so jealous. Like, I want to be an auntie. Uh, <laughs> you know, right yeah. That's, yeah. That's, uh, <laughs> John, we've seen you direct some of the most iconic films out there. We mentioned Boys in the Hood, yeah. Poetic Justice, Higher yeah. Learning, Four Brothers, one of my favorite movies. Oh, yeah. How much different is it in a series like this when you have a lot more time to tell the story rather than just two hours? We don't have, we don't have a lot of time to do it, but it's great because we, we have phenomenal actors and, you know, we don't even really rehearse. We'd have a, we have a read-through and then we're, we're pretty much on the set doing it and so they make it happen. They just, you know... They embodied these characters. Yeah. Right. They always say that 90% of directing is as actors. So, right. you know, when you, what you see on, on our show is basically due to them. John, what do you prefer now after doing some of both? Do you prefer movies or do you like the TV genre? I'm loving TV right now because I'm able to like. <laughs> Be, I'm not just saying this because you guys are, but I'm saying <laughs> it's like it's it's like you're on you're able to make a movie every week, right? As opposed to making a film, you make a film every few years, but it's just 
it's quick and it's spontaneous. Are right? you this laid back on set? I, I should be asking you three. That's is intense. he this? Because he seems pretty cool. Oh, no, I'm intense. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm Are intense. You, you cannot get hot. You cannot I don't get hot. No, I get, I get a surprise. They do something good, like and Carter tell you, like, I just, you know, I, I, I get. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's, like, it's yes, hard yes. to imagine that. Let's do it again. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. And you know? Danson, you, you have to change your accent completely. Mm -hmm. uh, what's the hardest thing about speaking like we do? Oh, wow. Um, <laughs> Uh, trying to be cool while I do it, I think, is the <laughs> hardest thing. Yeah. yeah. But let's hear you tell uh, the American accent. You have an American accent, but you also have a street accent. Too. Yeah, I mean... Well, I we would, want to combo I, the both. The I American would, street accent. Yeah. Uh, accent. You got to watch the show, man. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> John Damson, <laughs> Carter, and Angela. Good to see you guys again, of course. And you can catch season two episodes of Snowfall on Thursdays at 9 p.m. on FX. We'll be Hey, if you like that video, be sure to subscribe to our ABC7 Chicago YouTube channel.